Hello, my name is Jeff Chatton, and this is a 1909 Kissel semi-racer. Uh, Kissel car was made in Hartford, Wisconsin, and they made about 35,000 cars, which I didn't realize until I owned a Kissel. And uh, they have a, have a Kissel Museum in Hartford, Wisconsin. Uh, this car is unique and is one of the first six cylinders that Kissel made. Uh, this car was, was rated at 54.6 horsepower, which was a, a good sized car back then. It has a 504 cubic inch motor. Uh, and what it's really claimed to fame was is they, you could drive this car to a race and all the fenders and lights and everything could be bolted off and then you could go racing. And from uh, scars and uh, dents on the frame, you can tell that this car must have raced a little bit and the driver probably had, probably had a few bumps on him. Uh, you know, the uh, unique thing is of these six cylinders, this is the only six cylinder that has survived of the early style. Uh, there are later ones, but uh, none of this style. Um, what kind of horsepower does this get? Uh, they rated it at 60 horsepower, uh, but horsepower ratings back then, you know, were all over the place. And, and basically, what the the thing is is the torque is really what makes the big difference on these cars. Uh, you know, this car I've driven on several tours. You know, it likes to run long, about 45 to 55 miles an hour, uh, real comfortable. Uh, but with no windshield, uh, you sort of it sort of makes it interesting. Uh, I've driven it through a few rain, few rainstorms, and and you do get wet. Thank <laughs> you.